Welcome dear students, this is Dr. Hadi here. Today's topic is comparison between the DNA and RNA. Dear students, we already discussed a lengthy, a highly conceptual and lengthy video lecture on the nucleic acid where you can find full detail from A to Z. Today's lecture is comparison between the DNA and our RNA. In comparison, we will see the similarities between the DNA and RNA and the differences between the DNA and RNA. Those students who have not seen my previous lecture on the DNA structure and composition, I would request them to please watch that video first and then watch this video. We'll come to the similarity first. Uh, in similarity, the very first point between the DNA and RNA is that both molecules are polymer. Polymer means that uh, there is there are small units, small units combined together. You can see this is one small molecule, another small molecule large number of small molecules when combined together it will give us what it will give us a polymer and before they were uh, combined they are called as monomers and once they combined it will give us polymer now this circle each circle represent a single unit and this circle represent nucleotide nucleotide right new nucleotide so you can say many nucleotides combine to form dna or rna then we have another point biological molecule both the dna and rna are biological molecule as you know biological molecule are those molecules which are found in the living cell in the living system just like carbohydrate, protein, lipids, these are biological molecules. Similarly, the DNA and RNA both are biological molecules. They both belong to nucleic acid. Both belong to what? Nucleic, nucleic acid. And a detailed video lecture is available on the nucleic acid. The third point is nucleotide. This point is already discussed. What is nucleotide? A nucleotide is the smaller unit in the nucleic acid. These smaller units, nucleotides, combine together to give us DNA or RNA. So this is the repeating unit. You can say nucleotide is the repeating unit. This repeating unit is present in both DNA and RNA. Both DNA and RNA are heredity materials, means they can be transferred from parents to offspring, from parents to offspring in different organisms, just like every organism give rise to uh, give birth to their uh, uh, offsprings. So during this uh, transformation, the parents copy information to the offspring and what is the the, the the mean of this transfer is heredity material so this heredity material in some organism DNA and RNA these two serve as the heredity material and then we have both contain pentose sugar this is uh, very important if I write here pentose sugar uh, I, ha I have to write once again the structure of a nucleotide if I see the structure of nucleotide it consists of a five corner ring because a five corner ring this five corner ring is called as pentose sugar pentose sugar because there are five carbon atoms fine that is what that is pentose sugar okay and in this pentose sugar, uh, you will find here a nitrogenous base. It is another compound, nitrogenous base. And here you will see a phosphate, right? So these three components combine together to give us what? 
a single nucleotide and for your convenience and simplicity we write a nucleotide as a single simple that circle right this is circle for convenience for simplicity and it's called nucleotide but the original structure of nucleotide is it contains three components one compound another compound another compound right nitrogenous base pentose sugar and phosphate so what i want to say that in both the dna and rna these three components are present nitrogenous base sugar and phosphate these are present in both dna and rna so here we discussed similarities now we will shift to the differences between the dna and rna what are differences if we see uh, dna is double stranded how I mean if you see here you will find that dna consists of one polymer one nucleo uh, one polymer one chain of course here nucleotides are present so many nucleotides you make a polynucleotide a polymer and there will be another there will be another polymer which also contain nucleotides so as a result this become double stranded this is called as double stranded but in rna you will find only one strand one single strand in this single strand however you will find nucleotide as well so nucleotide are present in both but rna single strand and dna is double strand so here i would write i would like to write single strand single stranded then we have deoxyribose sugar in dna the sugar that i have already discussed here in dna the sugar is deoxyribose what is what is mean by that that if you see here uh, a pentose sugar fine this is carbon number one this is always carbon number one and this is carbon number two at carbon number two usually oh is present at carbon number two hydroxyl group is present when this oxygen is removed from carbon number two then only h will remain there this kind of sugar is called as deoxyribose sugar but in in the rna you will find only ribose sugar you will find only ribose sugar and what is ribose sugar in ribose sugar you can once again you can write the same pentose sugar there is carbon number one there is carbon number two but here at carbon number two the oh will be present intact means oxygen will be there so in a uh, sugar like this is called as ribose sugar and this is called as deoxyribose sugar is a difference then we have heard that in the dna and rna nitrogenous bases are present nitrogenous bases are mainly five types mainly of a, they are classified into two categories pyridine and furin but pyrimidine and furin but uh, they are five in number total they are five in number adenine is a nitrogenous base guanine cytosine thymine and uracil these five are nitrogenous bases among these five adenine is present in the dna guanine is also present cytosine is also present i have not mentioned the name adenine guanine cytosine because i'm expecting that you might have uh, uh, watched that video which i have recorded about the nucleic acid in that video i already discussed what is adenine guanine cytosine and thymine so i cannot repeat here once again okay so thymine is also there but the fifth nitrogenous base uracil is not present here so that's why i'm going to write a circle here around it and i will make like a cross like this uracil is not there in the dna and and do you know in which nucleotides place it would it has to come Ura, uracil usually its place was thiamine so thiamine thiamine will be there and uracil will not be there this place is for uracil and in case of rna in case of rna adenine is present guanine is present cytosine is present but this fourth place thymine should have should come there but 
Taimin will not be there, Urasil will be there, Taimin will not be there. So in simple word, in simple word, uh, Urasil is not present in the DNA. In RNA, thymine is not present. So you can say in place of uracil, thymine is there. And what we say in place of thymine, uracil is there. So it's in simple word. Now we single type of DNA. DNA is only single type, but RNA is of three types. One is messenger RNA, mRNA. Okay. Second one is uh, ribosomal RNA. And third one is small t RNA, transfer RNA. RNA molecule is of three types the name is mentioned but dna is of single type they have different functions now the next point is store biological information dna store biological information in the form of gene that uh, whenever you uh, you heard the word gene a gene is the part of the dna and we also say that gene is the unit of inheritance gene is that is that unit that transfer biological information from parents to offspring it is the dna that is transferring from parents to the dna uh, from parents to the offspring sorry that molecule which serve to carry biological information from the parents to dna uh, for, oh my god from parents to the offspring is called as the dna and dna is the heredity material so dna is the heredity material it store biological information biological information means your body structure eyes your body parts this this th these are your these are the biological information and these information are stored in the dna in the form of gene now here rna in majority of the cases is made from the DNA let's suppose this is the this is the DNA right double stranded from this DNA a single stranded polymer is formed which is called as RNA so in simple words the informations which are present in the DNA the biological information in the in the DNA will be copied in the form of uh, RNA so RNA will be formed from the DNA this is the difference and then about the heredity material RNA is the heredity material in viruses in, 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 in some viruses not in all viruses in some viruses RNA is the heredity material means viruses use this molecule to replicate to reproduce but there are some other viruses which use DNA as a heredity material. So this point should be noted. Fine. And RNA cannot be found as a heredity material in other animals like uh, human, like trees, like other animals. But the DNA can be can serve as a heredity material in in what? In viruses. Okay, in viruses, plants and animals so this was the difference between the dna and rna i hope you enjoyed watching this video uh, have a nice day remember us in prayer thank you bye bye